Hi guys, it's Daniel here, and uh, today I'm going to show you a video of my favorite Mac applications. Um, these are very useful and helpful apps in our everyday lives, especially for me. Some of these apps will cost money, but most of them are free, and that will help you find an alternative if they do cost money. Uh, my first app I'm going to show you is Alfred. Alfred is a more enhanced spotlight. Um, there's more settings, settings to it. You can have preferences, change the features, uh, you can change the appearance of it. It's really cool. Um, I use it all the time. And uh, next application is I'm going to show you is caffeine. Right here. Caffeine, I just turn it on. It's right here, the little thing. I can shut it off and on. Um, when it's on, that means your laptop will never go to sleep. So let's, this is really good when you're watching a movie or just browsing the internet um, you can literally go play like go outside for like five six hours come back and when the caffeine is on the whole monitor will be on the whole entire time it's free um, and it's really good when, especially when you're with your friends or maybe but I highly recommend you to get this um, next application is app cleaner app cleaner is really good to be honest uh, most people I think by dragging an application to the trash will delete the app completely but no it leaves files behind and when you leave files behind um, it takes up space and makes your computer slower so I'm going to give you an example of how to delete an application so for example I'm going to drag Spotify into there and it gets all the information or anything linked to Spotify if you press delete it's completely gone so it's really good um, to save space and to leave your Mac faster. And then the next application is Kiz Kizmac. Kizmac I will not show you how to use it because if I do it will show my uh, neighbors Wi Fi's but this is the ultimate Wi Fi cracker. Um, let's say you want to go to your friend's house and you don't they don't know the Wi Fi password, you can quickly crack it or um, let's say here well that's the legal way to do it you need permission but most people do this legally and I do sometimes I'll admit but not as much um, if you want to go to the airport anyway you can crack in there um, anywhere you go you can crack the Wi-Fi with this application um, be very careful with it though um, I'm just showing you this for educational purposes but just be careful with this because people have gotten caught and Oh, that's not good. Next application is Bump Top. Um, this is a really good way to keep your desktop organized. Uh, maybe when you're studying, especially, uh, it's like 3D. It's really cool and it's fun actually. You can mess around with it. But uh, you, let's say on the left side you're gonna have your notes. The top you can have videos. Maybe applications on the right side. It's very organized. It's really cool. It's free. Uh, I'll get this as well. You can as you get more. You can get more, uh, there's more things to this. I'm just showing you the brief explanation. But I re recommend you to get this app as well. Next application is Google Chrome. Okay, so Google Chrome, he, we all know it's a different browser. Um, to be honest, it is faster than Safari, and it's been proven. Also, if you're running, this is also a um, good. It seems like it's a Mac integrated uh, browser, but it's actually not. But I personally like it a lot. I uh, have everything organized on it. Um, you should get this as well. Uh, you should get rid of Safari and use this. So, this is just a advice. It's a really good application as well. Uh, the next application I'm going to show you is Retorn. Okay, so let's say are you if you're the type of person that likes to download from the internet, I really recommend this for you. Um, if you like to pirate things, uTorrent is the best. If you want to download stuff from the internet, this is really good. Um, just in general, a good application. No viruses at all. Um, and this is really... I personally love you love to use this all the time. And um, I got into it. So these are, these are the applications that I personally liked, like and I use every day. Uh, I hope I show you some new applications that may help you um, if not leave a comment or just 
All I'm going to say is thank you for watching and I uh, hope you subscribe. Thanks.